I'm Megan Olivi, and here's what you need to know in your UFC Minute. This weekend, we have a stacked card with tons of solid fights with a main event you won't want to miss. When this fighter first began competing, the goal was always the same for the talented mixed martial artist, to win a world championship. This weekend, live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California, the star gets his long awaited crack at the UFC middleweight crowd in a fight that has fans around the world buzzing. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. So here's the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world making the walk, looking to defend his title. It is certainly something that he's been able to do in the past. He has been challenged on this title run. It's not as though he has run a rough shot through this division, but they're all still chasing him at 185 pounds tonight. At least on paper, could be his most difficult challenge today. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. Till the date for this, our main event of the evening. More than five years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed USC Middleweight Championship of the World. This one is the first. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 22 wins, one loss. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting out of San Jose, California, presenting the challenger, Lines. You ready to fight? Ready. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. Well, it's good to see this man back inside the octagon. Round one getting underway here. As many of you know, he won his last fight by blistering knockout. His popularity has absolutely soared since. So with momentum tonight, he'll try to keep the winning streak. Oh! The champ is in big trouble. He's in deep danger right now. Who saw this coming? He's got him hurt here. Whitaker's hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Oh, he missed that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. And lands a good shot. He hurt him with that hole. Oh! He's got him hurt here. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, that's a good strike there by Whitaker. How about that chin? Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable. Oh, oh he's out. Oh. He's out. Landed a hard kick for the knockout. Oh, that was a no-doubter, Joe. That might even impress the likes of Edson Barboza. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent tonight. He couldn't have caught him much more flush than that, Joe. Full force, 
beautifully extends the leg right to the target, and that is the end of the fight. You gotta think his paycheck could be $50,000 richer after that highlight turned in here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Here it is one more time. Bang.